Hey, I'm Alex and I paint tiny things. Edge highlighting is our next technique to tackle. Put simply, this is the act of painting just the very edges of a miniature in order to bring up the sharpness, contrast and visual appeal of the model. It's not something you need to do, but it's a commonly accepted way to achieve a pleasing finish on models and it's often a technique used by Warhammer's heavy metal team to great effect. Edge highlights are often the brightest part of an area on a model and may also contain more than one shade or colour. With a suitable dilution of paint on your brush, you can run your brush along the edge of the section you're painting and let the model do most of the work. If using the edge of the brush is not possible, you'll need to get good at holding the brush steady and making sure your paint is the right consistency. It's not essential to edge highlight all the elements on a miniature, you can also highlight towards the very corners of panels or the uppermost edges of an element with brighter colours. Some painters do a wider edge highlight, followed by a thinner one within that previous line. Some will use a gradient or taper the highlight off with some dashes or dots. You will also often see pin highlights or very bright dots in places like the uppermost corners of armour or weapons just to make sure a material seems extra shiny. Assuming this is your final step, you'll wish to move on to varnishing from here, but feel free to explore all the videos in this series to get a full grasp of the end-to-end -end painting process.